effects. You know, go make, make a wish foundation. I can't remember what the URL was, but uh, it's on our website. Please, or their website. So go donate. Be a part of it. it it's a great thing to, to make a child's wish come true. But joining me, we have Sherry Schiller, our good Hi. friend. How are you doing? I'm doing great. How are you? You're great. Oh, you always look wonderful. Yeah, right. You do, you, you do. Boys around here. I don't look like <laughs> what you got? I have a mask for you. One really? for you. We're going to put it on. Come on, let's do it. This is for Feast of the Dark. Oh, this is tomorrow. This is, this is tomorrow. How do we look? How do I look? Oh. Not so yes. good. <laughs> I bet you everybody thinks my face is covered. I look even better. So tell us about Feast of the Iguana. Like, no, not that's tomorrow. Feast of the I mean, Dawn. <laughs> no, it's Feast <laughs> of the Dawn. Let's take these masks off. Maybe yeah. they're <laughs> Feast of the Dark. Yeah. Of the Dark. I'm yeah, sorry. That, that's I, I okay. Say. That's okay. That's tomorrow, and it's a costume party. Now this is yeah. kind of a pre. It, this for this, Guavuine, isn't this it? This is the very first year that we are the official um, kickoff party for. For guava wing. Now I saw your website. There's mm -hmm. ghosts and goblins, and mm -hmm. there's 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 web, web and tons of things to do. Absolutely. There. And a, de a karaoke tomorrow night oh. afterwards. Oh, we, during, during. We have John, who's the most fabulous DJ and karaoke. He's there every Friday, every Friday. But then he comes sometimes too on Saturdays. But what I really want to tell you about is all of our great events. Feast of the Dark is tomorrow, and it's twenty dollars, and it is a fundraiser for the Tampa Historical Society. Which and is a great uh, society to uh, donate money to. Absolutely, too. it's $20. Right. Did I mention that? And that's a band, and we have food, and we're going to have some students from the International Academy of Design, and they're going to bring their candy costumes. They're going to wear nice. them. So that's going to be a blast. Nice. Yeah. And, and then you're, more importantly, not, I should yeah. say, it's uh, the Wounded Warriors yes. project that you're associated with. Tell us about that. Okay, that's coming up actually on November 9th, which is a Sunday. We're going to be going all day. We're and there's to, kid activities. Oh, there's going to be all kinds of really fabulous events. The um, McDill Air Force Pay CENTCOM is going to have some static displays. And also, is it SOCOM, Special Ops Unit? Mm -hmm. They're going to be there as well. We're going to have Tampa Fire and Rescue involved. And the neat thing is we're going to have a pinup girl contest. I saw that in 30 seconds, yeah, Wounded sure. Warriors, what, what is that? I it mean, is it's pretty self-explanatory for people who don't know. What well, it's it's an organization to help not only soldiers presently, but from the past as well, and it helps their families. It's, they give donations and just give a lot of support, and it's just a very, very top-notch organization. And it helps keep people uh, keep people together. Um, that they're uh, like wounded warriors and their family members, so they can become friends, and it's yes. a great thing to be involved with. Yes. Give us again the the date that, that is. You can yes. buy tickets online, or you will be able to. They're not up presently. November 9th, which is a Sunday. And again, we have uh, swing bands coming in. We have solo acts. It's just going to be a day filled of wonderful, wonderful events, fun, and some serious things, too. So you can bring your children? Absolutely. Now, I saw some dogs on your website. Oh, Who's my that? gosh. <laughs> what were the dogs? <laughs> Actually, on Saturday, we're having pet bulls pounding the pavement. That's another group that's coming in to meet at our place and then walk the streets of Ebor just to teach responsible pet ownership with pit bulls. But we do pets on the patio the first Saturday of every month. And the last two um, months, we've had about 15 Great Danes there. Really? And it is a hoot. And we just, all kinds of animals. Do you have big, huge vats of dog food that they can all <laughs> We have pools for them. <laughs> we have buckets for them to, to drink out of. And um, we also are going to be having different charities involved. Right. We just haven't gotten to that point yet. You know, I remember when you guys bought the place, mm -hmm. and you opened up, and mm -hmm. it was a little, but the, the impact that you've made in this community here is amazing. Give us your website again so Absolutely. your calendar is there. They can get all the information oh, they Oh, thank want. you for saying that because it is a, it's been retooled. It's a fabulous website. It is. It's uh, gaspartsgrotto.com. Very easy. Just Very like easy. Uh, get on there. there. We have our bands listed, our events. It's just great. Can I keep this mask? You can. Really? Aren't can, they can nice? They're, they're actually nice. They're, they're very nice, yes. Sherry, thank you very okay. much. Good luck tomorrow. Thank I'll you. I'll see you in Guavaline. Absolutely. Are you going to be a pirate? Of course, right. a wench. We're going to take our next <laughs> break. As soon as I return, I'm going to be chatting with Hal Sparks. Tampa Bay's Media Talk is presented by Tampa Digital Studios and sponsored by the Creative Loafing, and we'll see you here in 60 seconds. <laughs>